Good afternoon, Boujou everyone. My name is Justin Hansen. I'm a peer specialist and the uh, garden coordinator with the Healing Garden. I uh, work out of the New Jumo Awaywin Center. And we have, uh, I'm in charge of something new here at the farm. We have added uh, a hive of honeybees at the farm. So it's something new and exciting that um, I'm looking forward to sharing with everybody. I will keep uh, videotaping throughout the summer. Uh, on the progress of what's going on out here and it is a beautiful day here in Redcliffe uh, Just gorgeous out. So uh, very sunny pardon the sunglasses, but uh, yeah, it's really sunny out nice day So let's go see what we got going here in, in the hive So here's the hive. It's just a uh, one box for now But that's the whole point of today's visit is I'm gonna check it out and see if we need to add a second box on top for the bees um, we're planning on well, hopefully by fall, running two boxes to uh, hopefully they have enough um, supplies to make it through the winter. They need honey to make it through the winter for themselves. So we'll see what's going on. All right. You always approach the hive from the rear. Let's see what we got going on here. be pretty healthy there's a bunch of bees just looking for the queen on the lid I've been told always look for the queen on the lid I don't see her Nothing in that frame, but that was a new frame that I added. I don't expect to find anything on that one. Let's get these separated and see what we can find. You always want to move pretty slowly. So they're working that comb out really nicely. Getting this one all prepared for, for eggs. Nice. Let me give a little smoke. Driving down into the hive. Okay, let's pull this frame out. This one's one of the frames that we got with the new bees that came with them. That looks nice. Brood in the middle. There's a drone. I'm just looking for the queen. here but I mean that's what they look like big old group of bees I do see something that's a little suspicious that I'm gonna get rid of and that's this right here
see the queen on that one. on here. Lots of brood. Lots of babies capped up inside their little homes. And I'm trying to be I'm being stung here on the pan. I don't see the queen on that one either, but it looks good. It's finally getting warm up here. We'll get some action on these highs finally. It's been cold. I don't do a lot of moving around in the cold. Let's see what we got here. Lots of brood. There's the queen. I see the queen. I don't know if you can see it, but the queen is right there. She's got a longer body and tiny wings. So we have an active queen. That is a good news. Lots of brood, lots of little babies. Looking good. There's a little bee with some pollen on it. Looks like they're stocking this one. Lots of brood on the back. And then we got an empty frame here. They're starting to pull that one out a little bit. I'm not gonna worry about that. We got our feeder. They look good. An active queen. Good news. Squish all these together. Get these back in the hive.
push everything together nicely. Scrape some of this stuff off. It's called bird foam. But you don't want to leave it lying around. You got to take it with you. Otherwise, you'll attract other bees. They look good. I don't think I need to add the second box yet, just added some new frames. I'm gonna remove the feeder that we had in there full of sugar water. They've got a ample supply, I think now, of extra food, um, but it's empty, so I'm gonna bring it back and maybe make up a new batch just in case. So uh, yeah, this is where we are. Hopefully this will grow and we'll uh, add more bees over the years. Thanks for joining me.